Hello class. Now in this lecture we will see the classification of the two-wheeled frame on the basis of the shape. Okay. On the basis of the shape, on the basis of the shape of chassis, uh, two-wheeled chassis, they are classified as of diamond frame, cradle frame, backbone frame, underbone frame, trellis frame, perimeter frame, and monocoque frame. And and by some by summing the features of diamond frame and the perimeter frame, we are getting another shape of frame that is called as a delta box frame. So we will see one by one the features or significance of the uh, frame which is classified on the basis of the shape. The first of all, we will see the diamond frame. Okay. So in a diamond frame, the steering head is connected to the chassis via single or double beam of to the engine. Okay, so this is the shape of the diamond frame actually. Okay, so in diamond frame, the steering head is connected to the chassis, connected to the chassis via single or double beam to the engine. Okay, so this is the down tube. Okay, and this is the head tube. So that head tube is connected to the engine, but with the help of two tubes like here you can see the single tube is here okay like here single tube is there which is coming from the head this is a head tube this is called as a head tube okay and th from this head tube only single tube is going towards the engine in this empty space engine will be there okay so this uh, only single tube is go going towards the engine and in this case the two tubes from the head head tube is uh, going towards engine okay second thing the engine is hanging off the backbone and is trace member of the frame okay so this this is called as a down tube this is called as head tube this is called as a main tube and this tube okay this is called as a backbone okay so the engine is hang in between down tube and the backbone tube so you do main tube hai or your backbone tube hai in dono ke beech mein our engine kya hoga hang hoga and it is the one of the member okay it is one of the link and it is behave as a one of the link in the frame because uh, the, this down tube end and the backbone end are not connected by any digit rod okay it is only connected through a engine and that's why the engine is behave as a one of the member of the uh, this truss or this uh, frame and because of that whatever the impact is coming in front of the road wheels okay that will pushing the entire frame backward direction and that stays gate that force gate uh, uh, conveyed to towards the engine and that stays may be induced so this engine is need to be a uh, uh, what, uh, tough enough or uh, the heavily manufactured so uh, it can uh, absorb or sustain that for stresses coming from the road surface okay such a frame is very light in weight uh, and, and which allows a lighter for the lighter okay so as there are uh, member is missing okay one member is missing so comparative lighter uh, that allows to save a lot of making crad making the cradle hold and the engine allowing okay so cost cutting is there because instead of that uh, member we are uh, we are uh, treating engine as a one of the stress members so here a member add nikare which member that is uh, bar hum add nikare instead of that bar okay we are keeping or we are hanging the engine in between these two members so because of that one member cost is reduced and uh, it's uh, the time is reduced for manufacture okay now the engine treated as a stress member due to its approach exactly uh, as i told you ke waha ek member ke jagah engine ko locate kiya hai to engine behave as one of the member one of the link so to overcome that induced stress the casting need to be rigid enough jo bhi casing hai engine ka wo itna rigid hona chahiye ki wo uh, road stress absorb kare okay now as a cradle not covering the engine there is a chance of direct road impact engine with the speed breaker okay so ye jo cradle matlab uh, cradle in matlab ek just a uh, safety jo uh, hai safety grill bol sakte hai okay for sake of time so it is there is no any uh, member is passing under the uh, this engine engine uh, crankcase okay 
there is no any member uh, going uh, below from the engine so whenever uh, it uh, it will uh, this vehicle will cross the heavy speed breaker that if there is chances of impact of speed breaker and the engine casing this down casing so because of that this casing need to be made a he uh, stronger enough ki jo wo uska uh, jo impact force hai wo sustain kar sake so that's why it is a uh, it is what uh, it's not that much safe if high speed breaker speed breakers impact ho raha there is chances of a generation of crack in the crank case okay so this is the uh, some advantage and some disadvantage of your diamond brand. now why if we are calling it's a diamond because if you have a look uh, so it having a four sides the first side this is second side this is third side and this is a fourth fourth side okay so age number 1 age number 2 age number 3 and age number 4 okay so engine uh, is link engine is uh, treated as a link 4 link 1 link 2 and link 3 so in that sort four links are uh, come together to uh, to ge uh, generate that shape diamond that is called as a diamond chassis or diamond frame thank you